Imagine facing life's challenges with unshakable calm, untroubled by the turbulence of emotions. In a world where feelings often run high, the idea of emotional insensitivity can seem both appealing and perplexing. What if the key to a resilient, peaceful life lies not in avoiding emotions, but in mastering them? Today, we explore the art of emotional detachment through the timeless wisdom of Stoicism. Seven steps to unleash your inner Stoic and embrace emotionally insensitive living. Before we delve into these transformative steps, let's make a small yet significant connection. By subscribing and liking this video, you join a community of seekers on a path to inner tranquility and strength. Your support not only helps this channel thrive, but also keeps you linked to insights that can profoundly enhance your life. So, go ahead and click those buttons. It might just be the first step towards your journey of emotional mastery. In our modern world, emotions can often feel like an overwhelming force dictating our reactions and decisions. The Stoics, those ancient philosophers who valued reason and virtue above all, believed that true strength lies in emotional control. They taught that by understanding and mastering our emotions, we can live a life of serenity and purpose, free from the turmoil of unchecked feelings. Today, we will uncover seven practical steps inspired by Stoic principles to help you achieve emotional insensitivity, not by numbing yourself, but by cultivating a profound inner strength and clarity. These steps will guide you to observe your emotions without being controlled by them, fostering a mindset that remains calm and composed in the face of adversity. Join me on this journey as we challenge conventional notions of emotional health and explore a path to resilience and peace. By the end of this exploration, you might find that emotional insensitivity, when grounded in stoic wisdom, is not about being unfeeling, but about being unshakable, living a life of true emotional freedom and strength. Lesson one, recognize inner turmoil. You have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this and you will find strength. Marcus Aurelius. Understanding and acknowledging your inner turmoil is the first step toward emotional resilience. By recognizing the sources of your emotional disturbances, you can begin to address and manage them effectively. Start by regularly reflecting on your emotional state. Use journaling or meditation to explore your feelings and identify patterns of inner turmoil. Ask yourself what triggers these emotions and why they affect you so deeply. Reflect on past experiences where you felt overwhelmed by emotions. Consider how these situations could have been managed better by recognizing and addressing the root causes of your turmoil. Use these reflections to develop strategies for handling similar situations in the future. Engage in practices that help you stay mindful and aware of your emotions. This could include daily meditation, deep breathing exercises, or simply taking a few moments each day to check in with yourself. By staying attuned to your inner state, you can catch emotional disturbances early and address them before they escalate. By recognizing inner turmoil, you take the first step towards emotional insensitivity. This stoic practice helps you become more aware of your emotions and develop the strength to manage them effectively, leading to greater inner peace and stability. Lesson two, detach from desires. Freedom is the only worthy goal in life. It is won by disregarding things that lie beyond our control. Epictetus. Detaching from desires is a key stoic principle that helps you achieve emotional resilience. By letting go of excessive wants and focusing on what truly matters, you can reduce emotional disturbances and find greater contentment. Start by identifying your desires and examining their impact on your emotional well-being. Reflect on whether these desires are driven by genuine needs or by external influences and societal pressures. Understand that many desires are fleeting and can lead to dissatisfaction if left unchecked. 
Reflect on how your desires influence your emotions and actions. Consider times when unfulfilled desires caused you stress or unhappiness. Use this reflection to recognize the impermanence of desires and the importance of focusing on what you can control. Engage in practices that help you detach from desires such as minimalism, mindfulness and gratitude. Simplify your life by prioritizing needs over wants and appreciating what you already have. This approach fosters a sense of contentment and reduces the emotional impact of unmet desires. By detaching from desires, you cultivate emotional resilience and insensitivity to external pressures. This stoic practice helps you focus on what truly matters and find peace in simplicity, leading to a more balanced and fulfilling life. Lesson 3. Prioritize logic. If you are pained by external things, it is not they that disturb you, but your own judgment of them. And it is in your power to wipe out that judgment now. Marcus Aurelius. Prioritizing logic over emotions is essential for achieving emotional resilience. By using reason to guide your decisions and reactions, you can maintain a calm and composed state of mind. Start by developing a habit of questioning your initial emotional reactions. When you feel overwhelmed or upset, take a step back and analyze the situation logically. Ask yourself whether your emotional response is based on facts or assumptions and consider alternative, more rational perspectives. Reflect on past situations where emotions clouded your judgment and led to regrettable decisions. Consider how a logical approach could have resulted in a better outcome. Use these reflections to reinforce the importance of prioritizing logic in your future actions. Engage in practices that strengthen your logical thinking, such as critical thinking exercises, reading philosophical texts, or engaging in debates. These activities can help you hone your reasoning skills and apply them effectively in emotionally charged situations. By prioritizing logic, you reduce the influence of emotions on your decisions and actions. This stoic practice helps you maintain a clear and rational mindset, enabling you to navigate life's challenges with greater calm and resilience. Lesson four, stay unaffected by opinions. If you are disturbed by anything external, the pain is not due to the thing itself, but to your estimate of it. And this you have the power to revoke at any moment. Marcus Aurelius, Remaining unaffected by the opinions of others is crucial for emotional resilience. By focusing on your own values and judgments, you can maintain your inner peace regardless of external criticism or praise. Start by reflecting on how much you value others' opinions and why. Consider the impact that approval or disapproval from others has on your emotions and self-worth. Recognize that relying on external validation can lead to emotional instability. Reflect on the stoic principle that you have control over your judgments. Understand that others' opinions are often shaped by their own biases and experiences and do not necessarily reflect your true worth. Separate your self-esteem from the judgments of others and base it on your own values and actions. Engage in practices that help you stay centered and confident in your own beliefs. This could involve setting personal goals, affirmations, or regular self-reflection. Strengthen your inner conviction by living according to your core principles, regardless of external feedback. By staying unaffected by opinions, you cultivate emotional insensitivity to external judgments. This stoic practice helps you maintain a stable and resilient mindset, allowing you to live authentically and confidently. Lesson 5. Live by core principles. Waste no more time arguing what a good man should be. Be one. Marcus Aurelius. Living by your core principles ensures that your actions align with your values, providing a strong foundation for emotional resilience. By adhering to your principles, you create a sense of purpose and integrity that remains constant despite external circumstances. Start by identifying your core principles and values. 
Reflect on what matters most to you and what kind of person you aspire to be. Write these principles down and use them as a guide for your decisions and actions. Reflect on how living by your core principles impacts your emotional well-being. Consider times when you acted in alignment with your values and how it made you feel. Use these reflections to reinforce the importance of staying true to your principles. Engage in practices that help you live by your core principles consistently. This could include setting daily intentions, practicing self-discipline, and regularly reviewing your actions to ensure they align with your values. Surround yourself with people who support and share your principles as this can help reinforce your commitment. By living by core principles, you create a strong, stable foundation for your life. This stoic practice helps you maintain emotional resilience and integrity, allowing you to navigate life's challenges with confidence and purpose. Lesson 6. Accept life's transience. The universe is change. Our life is what our thoughts make it. Marcus Aurelius. Acceptance of life's transience is a fundamental stoic principle that helps cultivate emotional resilience. By acknowledging the impermanent nature of all things, you can reduce attachment and find peace in the midst of change. Start by reflecting on the impermanence of life. Consider how everything, including relationships, possessions and experiences, is subject to change. Recognize that resisting change can lead to unnecessary suffering. Reflect on past experiences of loss or change and how you manage them. Consider how accepting these changes, rather than resisting them, could have made the process less painful. Use these reflections to develop a mindset of acceptance for future changes. Engage in practices that reinforce acceptance of life's transience. This could include mindfulness meditation, journaling about your experiences with change, or studying stoic texts that emphasize impermanence. By regularly contemplating the fleeting nature of life, you can cultivate a sense of peace and detachment. By accepting life's transience, you develop emotional insensitivity to the fear of change and loss. This stoic practice helps you remain calm and composed, even in the face of uncertainty, allowing you to live with greater equanimity and inner peace. Lesson 7. Cultivate present awareness. The happiness of your life depends upon the quality of your thoughts. Marcus Aurelius. Cultivating present awareness is a key stoic practice for achieving emotional resilience. By focusing on the present moment and fully engaging with it, you can reduce anxiety about the past and future and find greater peace and contentment. Start by developing a mindfulness practice. This could involve setting aside a few minutes each day to sit quietly and focus on your breath, observing your thoughts and sensations without judgment. This practice helps you become more aware of the present moment and reduces distractions from past regrets or future worries. Reflect on how often your mind wanders to the past or future and how this affects your emotional state. Notice the difference in your well-being when you are fully present and engaged in the current moment. Use these reflections to motivate yourself to practice mindfulness regularly. Engage in activities that promote present awareness, such as mindful walking, eating, or listening. When you engage in these activities, pay close attention to the details of your experience, using all your senses to stay grounded in the present. This helps you appreciate the richness of each moment and reduces the tendency to get lost in thought. By cultivating present awareness, you enhance your ability to remain calm and focused regardless of external circumstances. This stoic practice helps you build emotional resilience and insensitivity to distractions, allowing you to live a more fulfilling and balanced life. Achieving emotional resilience through stoic principles allows you to navigate life's challenges with grace and stability. By recognizing inner turmoil, detaching from desires, prioritizing logic, 
staying unaffected by opinions, living by core principles, accepting life's transience, and cultivating present awareness, you can unleash your inner stoic and live a life of emotional strength and balance. As you apply these stoic lessons, you'll discover an unexpected twist. The journey towards emotional resilience transforms your inner world. You'll realize that true strength and peace come from within, and that by mastering your emotions, you can handle any external challenge with confidence and composure. The emotional climax arrives when you fully embrace these stoic principles and experience the profound empowerment that comes with emotional resilience. This realization is deeply fulfilling and provides a sense of liberation from the turmoil of unchecked emotions. Through this journey, you gain a profound philosophical insight. Stoicism is not about suppressing emotions, but about understanding and managing them effectively. By aligning your actions with your core values and staying present, you achieve a deeper sense of purpose and fulfillment. As this exploration concludes, some questions remain unanswered, inviting further reflection. How will these new insights shape your future interactions and decisions? What other aspects of your life will transform as you deepen your stoic practice? This open-ended conclusion stimulates your imagination and encourages ongoing contemplation, making the ending feel personal and engaging. In a powerful symbolic resolution, envision your emotional resilience as a steady flame within you, illuminating your path and guiding your actions. This flame represents the clarity and strength gained from stoic principles, helping you navigate life's challenges with unwavering composure. This journey mirrors the beginning, creating a sense of completeness and harmony. You started by seeking ways to become emotionally resilient, only to realize that the true journey was about mastering your inner world. Now, you return with deeper understanding and inner mastery, ready to embrace the future with newfound wisdom and strength. Now here's where it gets tricky, and we need your full attention. Reflect on your experiences and how these stoic strategies have influenced your emotional resilience. Here's the twist. I want you to share your thoughts and stories in the comments below, but only if you genuinely feel a deep, compelling urge to do so. Can you resist the pull of sharing your insights? Can you hold back your valuable wisdom from the community, knowing it might inspire and guide others on their own journeys? If you found these lessons valuable, consider liking this post and subscribing for more content on stoic philosophy and personal growth. By joining this community, you'll continue to receive guidance and support on your path to emotional resilience and mastery. Let's embark on this journey together, fostering a life of resilience, wisdom, and fulfillment. So, will you share your story, or will you keep it to yourself? The choice is yours.